It's 5.05 right now, and it is the same Seriously. old story for the Carolina Panthers. Trickery from another two-win team. And the Carolina Panthers, they gave up 29 straight points. They still had a shot to tie it at the end, and it didn't work. Well, now they are out of playoff contention. And our Anthony Castor is live for us this morning from Bank of America Stadium. Anthony, head coach Ron Rivera faced some pretty tough questions about the team's performance and his job security yesterday. Yeah, John, and unfortunately, we have seen this before. Another loss at Bank of America Stadium and really another week to figure out what went wrong. The Panthers, though, started out pretty good yesterday with a 14 and nothing lead, but the Redskins caught up quickly, scoring 29 straight points, leaving the stadium nearly empty by the end and a 29 to 21 loss for the Panthers. The Panthers are now five and seven on the season, and with their fourth consecutive loss, the team is not eligible for a playoff. They'll review the tape today to see where they can improve, but Jarius Wright and Mario Addison told us it all comes down to consistency. You know, if we don't start the game fast, we usually pick it up and then we start the game fast and we don't finish. So, you know, we have to put that together. It's never about who's the best team. It's about what team that plays the best that day. There's a lot of speculation over Ron Rivera's job security. Here's what he said when we asked what this could mean for his job. I'm not worried about my future. I'm worried about this football team's future. We got a game coming up on Sunday. That next game is in Atlanta against the Falcons. The team dominated Carolina just three weeks ago here in Charlotte. Coach Ron Rivera will hold a press conference later today. Of course, we'll be asking how the team is preparing for that game on Sunday following this devastating loss. We'll have that for you tonight starting on Eyewitness News at 5. John. Hey, Anthony, this one really stung. Thanks for the live report there. Also, during yesterday's game, Panthers tight end Greg Olson took this hard helmet-to-helmet -helmet hit right there. I'm going to show you, you know, again, this is Washington linebacker Ryan Anderson. He was pretty shaken up after that play. Uh, you can see here he just pretty much goes limp after taking that hit. We're going to walk you through the next step for Olsen's health as he is now in concussion protocol.